Hi YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to make a list of fonts in Visual Basic 2008 or 2010, whatever one you want. I usually use 2008 most of the time because I convert them to 2010, so I have both frameworks of them. So, um, alright, let's get started. First thing you want to do is open Visual Basic create a new uh, Windows Form application alright it's like the font list um, you want to name the form wh whatever you want Right there, you have it. Um, first thing you want to add is a list box. Put that in there. Um, go to docs. That. Go about like that, I guess. Next thing you want to do is a label. Uh, go to. and then you have to do that auto size and then it fills the box um, the next thing you want to do is double click the form go up here type this code, I will have the code in the description, put that right there, go into where it says form 1 underscore load, type in this, copy this, put this in there, oops, um, go to, um, double click the list box, here's the list box, and this is the only, that put this code in the list box, Save, save it, and then debug it, and then here's all your list. And if you want to change this, you don't need to keep it um, label one. You can change it to anything. Uh, you click it, and then you go to test, and then you do uh, type whatever. Uh, fonts and then you can put it in text align you can put it in the middle I guess and then then save it and run it and then you have it right here and there you go there's your quick access to all your fonts in Visual Basic 2008 and if you don't know how to convert it, continue watching this video. Otherwise, thanks for watching. Comment, rate, subscribe. And then, alright, now open up 2010. It opens it up. Hit open project. Go to visual, uh, go to 2008 projects. What you just did. And then you just open that one. And then welcome to Visual Studio Conversion Wizard. Convert it, yes, back up, hit next, finish. And there you go. What you just made in Visual Basic 2008 was converted successfully to 2010 edition. And it still works when you debug it. So thanks for watching, comment, rate, subscribe.